Hi everyone, and welcome back to my channel. It's Rog here, and well, to get away from cooking just a bit, I'm going to show you um, some veggies that I grow. Uh, a lot of you don't know this, but actually, I grow a lot of my own stuff that I use in my cooking, and um, I'm going to show you a bit of it because it's summer now, and everything is growing so well. So, let's not hang about, come and have a look. Firstly, if we take a walk up the garden that I've got here, and um, I'll show you some of the stuff that's uh, starting to grow. Actually, we're using some already, some of the lettuces and stuff. Anyway, let's uh, show you, where are we? Oh yeah, these are our tomatoes that are coming on quite well. Not fruiting yet, obviously, it's a bit early. I've got some, these ones are marmond, I've got alicante, I've got a stripy one there and some more stripy ones. Anyway, that's the uh, that's the tomatoes on this side. Up here, I've got some yellow tomatoes that have got to be potted on. I've got a lovely basil plant here. We use a lot of basil in cooking. And um, let's take you across to the other side, see what's going on. I've got lots and lots of plants. These are uh, peppers, uh, just capsicums. There's another one coming on over there, over this side. I've got a lovely, lovely cos lettuce that's coming on. And uh, over here, I've got a whole group of cos lettuce, lettuce that's got to be potted on. Going back down, more tomatoes. We never go short on tomatoes during the summer months. Anyway, let's move on. Over here, under grow lights, we've got some cucumbers. MC, that's a micro cucumber. I've never grown those before, but we're going to give it a go. Over the back there, I've got some just standard cucumbers coming on quite nicely, starting to get flowers on. So they won't be long now. Coming across, we've got some... First time I've tried this, I'm growing some radish but I'm going to grow those in these little plugs here and then put them back out to grow in the garden or in the field. I've got a field that I can use. I've got some rocket over the back and some red cos lettuce. That's coming through. That looks so good. Then just across here, we've got a pumpkin, another pumpkin, another cos lettuce. Lettuce is over the back. There's a very big sweet corn that's got to go out. Right, let's uh, take you out into the field. Down here, we've got sweet corn growing, picking up quite nicely. Over here, we've got raspberries. With a little little bee on there growing. Uh, doing his business, look, a bit of pollinating. We like pollinating, don't we? Over in the field, that's corn. It's not mine, it belongs to the farmer. Over here, um, we've got some onions that are coming on quite nicely. I've got to move these poles. These were here just to keep the um, wild animals off. We've got badgers and foxes and what have you. Down here, we've got some uh, radishes growing and parsnips too. Some of the parsnips are coming on really well. Got a lot of work to do, to be honest. Over here, starting to pick up a bit now. We've got marrows, courgettes, goods, more goods, courgettes, marrow. And over this side, we've got a very lonely marrow. A 
got to say, it's a terrific view. I love this view from here. In this trough, I've got some strawberries growing. It's a great idea to keep them off the ground. Those little slug critters love strawberries. So uh, I like to give them a little bit of a chance, really, a bit of protection. Anyway, the flowering, they're coming on really nicely. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed that little video of the um, produce, the veggies that I grow in my garden, and uh, using my cooking as well. It'll give you a little idea, you better have a go yourself if you like. It's also healthy and yeah, we like healthy, don't we? Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already done so. And I'll see you all again in the next video. So bye guys, bye for now.